All right, we are here at Big Data London. It's day one, and I'm with the co-founder of Altrix and Chief Data Advocacy Officer Libby Duen with me. Libby, welcome to the Ravid Show. It is fantastic to be here. Thank you, Ravid, for your for your time. Thank you very much for your time. And uh, today I have some interesting questions for you. Uh, I definitely we are here, and we'd be seeing almost like from the numbers that I've heard, there are 21,000 registrations that happened at Big Data London. So I'm pretty excited about the data community and I'm interested to learn more about what you think about you know, the data and analytics space and where it's going and what are the trends that you're seeing here? It's phenomenal to be here in London, 21,000 registrations as you yeah. said, for a conference about data. Who ever would have thought that all these people that are at this conference are the cool kids now? Exactly. Everyone is seeking that ability to understand more with data. Mm. They want to be able to work with data. Yeah. They want to be able to drive insights and solve questions with data. And that confirms what we've been seeing in yeah. the growth of data and the scaling of it across corporations, public sector, private sector, nonprofits. Yeah. Everyone is trying to figure out how to do more with data, and this conference is a clear indication of that. Um, and that ability for any business of any size to be working to solve with data. Yeah, I, I love it, and those are great points, definitely. In terms of you know having this big community is you know in itself says a lot in terms of where we are moving in the space. But that also brings me, since we are on this topic, that also brings me to another interesting topic. I know you have had a debate around generative AI. And I was interested to learn, you know, obviously keeping all the hype aside, there are real things happening in the space. And that's something that I would love to learn from you because you seem to be very interested in generative AI and you, you're actually making that difference in the space. So can you share about how businesses are actually solving problems in generative AI? Yeah, I, and I love the question because I sat out a panel today yeah. um, here at Big Data London, and the discussion really on our panel was, what do we have to be thinking about? Exactly. Is big is the whole concept of generative AI just hype? And I am very clear to say no, this is not hype. This is a technology journey that all of us globally get to be on together now, and we all get to, to, to say, we, we remember when generative AI was in its infancy. And so businesses and business leaders are all focused on what does it mean, what did they have to do to be on this journey with everyone, and how are they going to implement generative AI within their own organizations? And that's the power of the human, because the human is going to be at the center and will remain at the center of generative AI. Yeah. It's not about replacing humans, it's not about outsourcing to generative AI and we become unemployed, that is not what's going to happen. The human will remain at the center of this because it's the human that's going to be identifying how do we implement generative AI, yeah. what are the problems that we want to solve with it at scale, across their enterprise. Yeah. And the other part of generative AI is that it's going to create job satisfaction for people. Those mundane tasks are all going to get automated. You're going to, fo those employees are going to get to focus on better problems, higher value problems yeah. that are having that higher impact for business. Because that's where the power of them as employees and the human brain are going to come into play. And so, we're very excited about generative AI. Altrix is going to continue integrating uh, uh, Gen AI capabilities into our um, Altrix analytics platform and enriching that experience for all of our customers. Yeah, I love it. Uh, you know, I was just at a talk yesterday as well, and you know, we, we, we were hosting this event where someone spoke about generative AI. In, you know, they said completely, like exactly the same thing, where humans kind of play a very important role. Yes. And I like your, you know, your, your 
your approach where it should be where after a few years we can say we were a part of generative AI. Yes. Right? When it started and here we are, we are making that difference. Yes. So thanks for sharing that, Nibi. And also quickly, I, I know, um, you know, this is something which is interesting. I've written a question down for you, which is around inside data driven, um, you know, decision making is vital for growth, but many businesses still struggle with skill gap. So how, how is Altrix helping to address this? I love the question because it's about, again, the human. Yeah. It's about the human and it's about the data. Right. And so we want to make sure from an Altrix perspective as a global company that we're empowering and enabling the learning and the teaching of data. It is so important that mm. learners today, of any age, by the yeah. way, not just the, the, the primary age or secondary age or university age individuals, yep. Yep. but even people that are looking to come back into the workforce or maybe start a new career. It's open to everyone. Data analytics is powered by the human. And so we've got to continue to enable and upskill every one of these individuals. Right. And so Altrix launched about three years ago the Altrix Sparked Education Program. Yeah. And today our Sparked Education Program takes our technology platform, our analytics platform, and our learning curriculum into the classroom. We are serving over 1,100 higher education institutions. Oh, wow. And we've already enabled more than 150,000 learners to be able to take on what we refer to as modern data analytics learning. Yeah. And I'm intentional about saying modern because analytics today can't be accomplished with spreadsheets. It's got to be done with the right technologies yeah. and multiple data sources. And so our Sparked program is educating both students and professors on what modern analytics yeah, are for sure. and how can we enable those students when they graduate to enter that workforce and be employable on day one. Major. That's what is so critical because there's also a demand by commercial businesses, by public sector, by nonprofits to be analytics driven. And so as a student, as a learner, if yeah. you have that passion, you now have that opportunity to bring your analytic skills directly into the workforce on yeah. day one. Yeah. What's more powerful than that? I think spot on, you know, this is something which is, uh, you know, on my mind since a while, like companies like Altrix have actually done that, but a lot of companies wanting to get into the data and analytics space uh, are wanting to do this as well. And y'all y'all, y'all have set that benchmark there where, okay, you know, you come in, you learn, you upskill yourself, and then on the day one, you prepare to do something around the data and analytics, and you feel like a hero. Right, right? absolutely. So, uh, I think hats off to something, uh, you know, what you all are doing. Uh, I have a lot of friends who are all quick instructors who are doing and who are helping the community, and I've learn firsthand from them how deep into the data and analytics space they get into yes. uh, to make sure where the learners kind of get the education and are ready for yes. the big world out there. Yes. Okay. And I'll say, Ravit, that it's not just, it's not, if you go through the Sparked Education program, it doesn't mean you're going to be a data analyst. Exactly. You're developing the skills that are going to take you possibly on a data analytics career journey, yeah. but it will take you into marketing, it'll take you into finance, it'll take you into HR, it'll take you into supply chain or IT. Wherever your passion is, those skills are transferable into any one of the, any career. And so that's the, the opportunity that we're excited and we're most excited about the employability of every graduate of the Sparked program yeah. globally. Love it. I think uh, those are great points. I know for, uh, you know, we are here in September right now, but next month in October, Altrix is coming up with a data and analytics event. I guess it's on the 5th of October because yes. I'll be there. 
Yes. So I'm really excited about it, but I would love to learn from you uh, what are we going to explore at the conference and what can be expected. Yeah, I'm so glad you asked. And uh, Ravid, I'll repeat again, October 5th here in London, Altrix is sponsoring and hosting our annual customer conference called Inspire. Inspire. And the name Inspire is intentional about inspiring the data analytics world to come together, yeah. and it's going to be our customers, our partners, prospective customers, who are all coming together to talk about data analytics, their successes, wow. their learnings, and what better way to learn from than somebody who has been there and had that success themselves. Exactly. Yeah. And so Inspire, since its founding back in 2002, we ran our first Inspire conference, it's always been about the customer sharing their successes. Oh, wow. yeah. And so we're, we're very energized and very excited to bring, yeah. bring customers together. These are all data professionals, they're leaders, they're analytic professionals, and so it's all levels of the organization wow. coming together to support each other and, and share their, their world and their views yeah. on data analytics and where generative AI is going for them. Yeah, 100%, I, I love it, and thanks for sharing those details because I'm kind of interested always to, you know, whenever I look at a conference, I look forward to understanding what are the problems the customers are facing. Yes. That's like the key one, because once they kind of start sharing those problems, we kind of start figuring out the space as well. Where is it moving and how are the things, you know, and what are the companies, how are the tools helping, you know, to make that difference in their, you know, data world or their environment. Uh, so I can't wait for Inspire. It is uh, definitely uh, one of the biggest conferences. Uh, I know one, the one that you did in May. Yes. It was amazing. I I'm, I couldn't be there. It's such a bummer. But this time, I made sure on the 5th of October, I'm locking my dates. I'll be there as well. And definitely looking forward to learning more from you know the folks who are attending yes. and the customers and learning their experiences and uh, get inspired more. And that's exactly right, is, is everyone we promise we want them to walk away inspired. Awesome, this is amazing Libby. Thanks for doing this. I know you are, uh, you know, you're all around the place when, you know, you, when you're here, and you, you have so many customers you have to meet, but thanks for doing this. And uh, I'll definitely see you at Inspire on 5th of October. Thank you very much. Awesome, thank you very much. Thank everyone. you.